it's time to explain how to set up a company in QuickBooks. I'll be doing this demonstration today with Charlene. She's an experienced business owner, but she hasn't used QuickBooks before. Char, are you ready to get started? I sure am. Okay, selecting your industry. This is probably the most important step in the setup process because what this does will give you um, a preset chart of accounts by industry that hopefully will pretty closely resemble your actual business. Now we can always make changes to the chart of accounts later so we don't need to stress about it but we should look through the list to try to pick out the one that we think will get us the closest to get going. So if you'll just uh, click on that down arrow on the right side there and scroll down that screen. Excellent. Retail shop or online commerce? I think that will fit you just fine. I want to talk about this screen here about entering sales for, for a minute because this is pretty important. Um, the choices are to record each sale individually or to record only a summary and not put the detail in. I'm going to advise that we pick the option to record each sale individually just so we have that option. It doesn't mean we have to. We will be able to record daily and weekly summaries. If I got a if I got a daily report from PayPal, I could enter that as one thing. But then, if the next day I decided I wanted to enter them all individually, I could do both. But if Ex I chose record only a summary, I couldn't do individual ones and go back. Exactly. Is that correct? Exactly. Right. I okay. want to err on the side of allowing us to use more detail rather than less. It doesn't mean we have to do it. It just means we have the option. Okay. 